Welcome to another Nitro Type video with Dragon. Today it will actually be something different. I will be creating a 3D Nitro Type logo. So that red one with the the red, red square with the kind of funky shape and the N, that is what I will be creating. It will be 3D and then 3D printed. So I'll actually be able to have it in my hand. And then I'm actually gonna build a little stand for it so I can stand it up on things. But with that, let's go straight into the creation. So here I am where I'm gonna create it, and let's speed this up and add some races to see how many I can do while I'm modeling the logo. So here we go. Let's speed this up and add the races. Go! Looks like I didn't get that many races complete. I only ended up getting one to one and a half or kind of two if you count right now. But here is what the end product of the logo looked like. Bop! So there it is. It looks pretty cool. I think anyway. But now time to 3D print this. So here the 3D printer is and printing the logo and the trophy. It's kind of a trophy thing instead of the logo. But anyway, I'll turn on the music. Enjoy! my first 3D prints for a Nitrotype logo. I hope you enjoyed the end result, and now let's 3D print the statue part, or the part that holds the logo up. Unfortunately, I didn't get the full recording for the statue part or the part that holds it up, but I did get the beginning and end, so this is the beginning part, and I'll show you the end when we get there. Here is the end, just a lot less sped up.
So there we have it. There are the two models that were 3D printed. And now all that's left is putting them together and I want to paint it because otherwise the color doesn't quite match. So let's do that real quick and let's get into it. So with this painting part, I'm not necessarily amazing at having the camera at the right spot because you can't always see it. Sometimes the thing goes out of view completely, but colors that I decide to paint it, I decide to paint the logo, of course, the nitro type colors, white and red, and then as you can see the trophy right there, I just painted all yellow as like a trophy thing. So with that, let's show you the rest of this. And like I said, some of it's in and out, like right here, you can sort of see the 3D print, and actually that N, I'm, the only reason I'm painting it white on the one side is because the 3D print had an overhang, and I didn't want to use support material, so it kind of turned out so-so, and that's why I'm painting over it. But with that, I'll let you see the rest of this paint. So there we go, I have it now all painted, and once it dries, I'll be back to show you the completely finished paint job, 3D print, and all of that. But let's switch over to the finished product. Here it is, my very own nitro type trophy. So here it is painted, you can see the yellow, the white, and the red to make up the logo on top. <laughs> I think it looks turned out looking really cool and I'm very happy with it. Now I will show you another really cool image of it after I finish this video clip of just showing you the entire 3D model, which like I said earlier, I really like. But now, switching over to the image, this image is just the image with the background and I thought it turned out pretty cool. It was a cool looking image. And now, to the other image. This one is just the logo sitting on the computer with nitro type in the background and I thought this fit the logo very well and will probably end up being the thumbnail for the video. But anyway, I really hope you enjoyed seeing this video of Nitrotype's logo being created in 3D and then added to like a trophy thing. I really hope you enjoyed it. Hopefully I'll see you in the next video. And 